Here we go. One last fight and I'm home free. Kai, I just wanted to... Tell me after we're out. Jane, are we ready to go? Yes, sir. Aaron's waiting for you. Well, I wouldn't want to keep him. Welcome, sheep. I am the seventh. Yeah, you son of a bitch, I know. Let us go. Us? Naya, my dear, are you planning a great escape? Aaron. She's ours, Kai. Don't step beyond your boundaries. She can do what she... You're a walking, talking cliché. You know that? Everything is right or wrong, and you're so sure you can tell one from the other. We brought you here for your intelligence. And with any great intellect always comes some degree of arrogance. But don't assume you have any power here. We are the gods of this place, and we hold absolute control. I hardly need to point out the ethical missteps in what you've done, Aaron. If you're holding Naya against her will, and I'm assuming at this point you are, then we have nothing more to discuss. Indeed. Your final challenge, Kai. You'd do well to give your all. I passed your test, Shades. You're gonna let us both go. Young man, you presume much. No, Aaron, he's right. I can't do this anymore. Naya, you know the consequences of- I'll take my chances. I thought I could go through with this, but if anything, if anything had happened to him- I admit, you served your purpose here well enough. We would have preferred more than a single run, I suppose. But your performance as a shepherd was abysmal. A single run? So that's it? You're just gonna let me go? What the hell? Jane, report! The integrity of the system is being compromised via external influence. We saw these anomalies earlier, but they weren't as... Jane! Jane, are you there? Adele? What? That's not Adele. 
Someone is using her avatar. Hi, Naya, he's lying to you. It's just... I will not have some trumped-up hacker with a morality complex ruin the work this organization has put in. Mir, if you can hear me, shut it down. We've got what we need. No such luck. We're blocking root access. What the hell is going on? Who are you? My name is Shira. I'm part of a group opposed to the tower. Well, sign me the hell up. This place is pointlessly dangerous. No, Kai, listen. It isn't dangerous. You're in a computer simulation. A sort of virtual reality. What? Mir, shut it off! You were never in any real danger. You and Naya are just being used as genetic... Ayana, what's going... No, stabilize the injection. If we can... Aaron, our fail-safes are flushing the system. All non-locked actors are going to be removed from... Naya, what the hell is going on? I have no idea, honestly. What did Aaron mean about a single run? I... Don't lie to me, Naya. I'm not really an employee here, Kai. I woke up in a room with no memory of how I got there, just like you. But they... they wanted me to follow a script. They taught me how to operate the controls, how the tower worked, how to guide people through it. They introduced me to the Guardians and gave me a quick trial run up the tower. And then, you showed up. But I couldn't tell you anything. I was only allowed to release certain information at certain times to react in certain ways. They encouraged banter, conversation, but I couldn't really tell you anything. But why? Why would you help them? They said they'd kill me if I refused. And you threatened to quit, even knowing that? I thought... I thought they might have been bluffing, I don't know, but I couldn't be involved with, with killing people. Well, according to Shira, I was never in any danger. Not what they told me. If this is some kind of computer simulation, I doubt we could be hurt in any physical way. And if we're in some kind of medicated coma, it would explain why neither of us is getting tired, hungry, or thirsty. But the level of technology to pull something like this off, to completely and utterly fool our five senses, it shouldn't exist yet. And what did she say about genetics? I don't know. But we're at the top of the tower. If we head up those stairs, that should end the game, right? Worth a try. Up we go.